welcome back and i wanted to show you the lovely tiffany and co room and what it ended up and to show you so that is the lovely donut tiffany wall. And co, like, shop window kind of thing and then i created a board and painted it so i'm going to show you now how i did it all so if you all watch the next following video i am going to make a tiffany and co themed dinner meal and i'm so excited i can't wait to show you this is the lovely board excuse my fake tan it's terrible it is wash scrub day and i thought leave it till after the paint because the paint's going to be a mess i'm not joking i mean i'm wearing my worst my worst joggers anyway <laughs> so this is the lovely board that we are using lovely from being cute got it to stay with my papa and i will show you the paint this is the lovely oh my god color so basically what i did was i got them to scan my tiffany and co box and so they could like do the color and they've saved it on there under my name and look how gorgeous this is and apparently it's going to get a little bit darker but it will be the color of the box so brilliant thumbs up to that got a bit of paint on my finger also got a paint brush was seven pound i think but it is that whatever it is it's foyer 230 mm so it's pretty good stand stuff and also they cut off the gorgeous color beauties oh my god look how bright that is sorry i'm getting a bit scared there's pigeons around me like in my garden they were flying literally over me which is very strange um anyway i'm literally just gonna dunk this in like so and look how gorgeous that is oh my god and i'm gonna do that i think that's the best way of doing it and then what we're gonna do is i'm not gonna get it on the floor and then will kill me and just do that i think that is the best way to do it what is that pigeon doing oh my god go away this pigeon i'm not joking it's got issues right it keeps on going near me right i will show you beauties what this is all, all gonna look like when it's done Beauties, one more hour, and then it's all good. They'll paint the boxes now. I am literally just taking this white big box for the display. I'm just using the roller because it goes on evenly. Yay! There we go, and then I'll show you what it looks like after. meal and i am so excited it's massive and i can't wait to add all the little tiffany and co boxes inside so see you in a bit oh my god i can't believe i've just blown up all of those balloons i feel like i'm gonna die oh my god i've had a huge glass of water somewhere right so with these balloons i'm gonna add them onto my link because they're well cute but the problem is you can't blow them up too much so i thought i could attach them to a garland and make them like pearls which will look really cute and also i'm going to attach all these balloons because they're really similar color to the turquoise um kind of teal tiffany color and then i put this on the table put the sheet on the table and this is what i'm trying to work with at the moment i'm also going to add this on the amazon thing um for the links down below because it is from amazon and i'm starting on the garland at the moment these are really good because they've got the secure one so you just pull it oh god my fingernails you pull it to the side and then it locks the actual balloon in so i'm going to carry on with that and i'll show you what it looks like after Woo!
welcome into the kitchen. Today's video, we are making the lovely Madeira cake. Well, obviously, we're going to make it like Tiffany & Co style. So you'll see the decorations after, but first I'm going to make the face. And are you excited? Are you pumped? I know this isn't our normal cooking show. Normally, it's like, you know, style ups, hoist in, like stuff like that. But for today, we are baking this cake and we're going to make it look fine as hell. So let's start with, I think the first thing to do is to sift together the flour and baking powder. I haven't got a sieve, can't find one. So unfortunately, beauties, it's just gonna have to be that way. I'm gonna have to also move everything out of the way because you can't see me. I'm gonna start like, doing really weird things and you're gonna be like, what the hell is she all about? So this is our lovely flour, 500 grams. Oh my God, amazing. And we pop it in, obviously you can't see. So seven eggs, seven free range eggs from lovely Asda's. So what we're gonna do is, I think we're just gonna do it as normal. Stirring. Egg size free beaten. So egg, I don't know how people break an egg, people can do it with one hand, people can do it with two. I just tap it on here and then I just break it into there and it's kind of in there. I always end up getting a shell in there, which is so irritating. And it's like slimy in there as well. So it's not like one of those things that you want to like, you know, I'm just saying the word like. Do you know me, like not being rude or anything, I'm one of those people that just like, when they make cakes, they like to get it done, but get it done in the right way, not the wrong way. I'm just going to beat them until they're like slender and like, not slender, but they're like grouped together and they're like, oh my god, we've made it. It's kind of like a team thing. Oh my god, beauties. I've got the charm in there, the present in there, and then the stand in there. And I think I may have overflowed them. I didn't know that they so were going to go that big. Cake, but I tried. Thank you all so much for watching my video, beauties. I hope you really enjoyed it. And this is like the first ever proper vlog I have done. So I was so excited to get it done. There has been some traumas. There has been some experiences. And I enjoyed every single minute of it. And I just felt like it was it actually looked better than i thought it would look but yeah so if you want any other information of anything that i used or how i even did the cake like decoration wise i can do a separate video of that um but yeah i didn't actually film it so i can redo the cake if you all want help on that but yeah other than that it was such a good video and thank you all so much for joining hugs to you i know it's been a long time coming with this video and i have been off youtube for a couple of um times but have an amazing day all of you beauties and i can't wait for my other videos that are coming up i've got my birthday video obviously my bag video and some other videos that i have got so i can't wait to share it with you but everyone have an amazing day stay safe and stay well and keep on celebrating